This has been a big experience, a massive experience for us, uh, for every single player and every single member of our Breeder Football Club. You know, the club has you know, had to go through this COVID thing and do everything and the experience of it all. It will make us all better people, I think. We're now wiser to the situation of COVID. We know what it needs to get on a game of football. There's so many things to do. It's, it's all about trying to get back to where we were, where football was two years ago. They're definitely up for it. You're not going into the game thinking, you know, we haven't got a chance here. You've always got a fighting chance. You know, it's going to be a tough one. It's going to be a totally different game in the aspect. But the strangest things have happened, and it's what's staying in the game as long as we can. The slap on the wrist, the IFA, give us things like that there. The sort of, you know, put a wee bit more fire in the belly. Reflecting on the game, you know, the boys give their all. You can see they go from class, they go from what Crusaders have been playing all season, we're only in their second game, third game of the season. Uh, they're sharper, they're quicker, you know. That there are 40, 30, 40 games more than us does. Does show in the park, but again, you cannot take away the quality in which Crusaders have right throughout the squad from the goalkeeper right through to every single sub in the park. This club can actually go on and do great things, I think. It has all the facilities, a great pitch, uh, great training facilities, warm-up pitch, they have absolutely everything. We just need everybody to buy into what we're doing. You know, at the minute, we're, I'm still in the early stages of making that breed a, hopefully a better place, and the committee are giving me their full backing from the top to the bottom. Our league starts on the 7th of August, so we need to be ready to go again. We need to maybe add to the squad, make the squad bigger. But this year's been a great experience for the players. They've come in, we've been able to train, they've got ourselves to gather, and we've you know, we've been a wee family there for a month, which was really good. Branyo, and I knock Brita. I'd be saying to any local kids in the area, please come and join, please come up and see. They'll enjoy it. And there is a pathway right through. There's three or four boys there in the squad today can have come through the system at knock Brita before I was even here. And I'm only getting the benefit of them now. So the quality's there. And there's that wee chance for the local kids to come and do well at uh, knock Brita Football Club. <laughs>